Right lads, this moving is by like you Martin, Jets Martin, Martin Corcoran, or whatever it is. Martin, let's clear up a few things with you, just to kind of rectify this problem. But I knew it was going to come with you one way or another. This is why I asked for the last couple of months, Martin, to get this money down. Martin, you sent for fight twice now, Martin. You're saying I sent for you, Martin. I couldn't give two rats arse, Martin, and an arse about fighting you, to be honest with you. Because by me fighting you, I have nothing to prove whatsoever. Man, you screamed and shouted and made WhatsApps to me, Ophelia. Ask him for one of Michael Stokes' sons. Begging, matter of fact, begging for one of his sons to come out to you. Literally realise, man, that holidays don't last and people come home. Do you understand? So my Ophelia made a WhatsApp back to you, man, and told you exactly what's what, Martin, in the situation we're fighting. He told you, Martin, that Mr. Man had taken up the challenge in three months' time. The whole country heard it, Martin, and you knew exactly what he was on about. Then you say, Martin, when I came back to him, that I didn't get back to you. Martin, he made the WhatsApp. You didn't accept it. You didn't say, like you were screaming the first, you didn't scream the second time, Martin, making WhatsApp, saying, I will fight him, no problem. Or he didn't bait me. Martin, you never said nothing. Then my, my ovary gets a, gets a phone call of a certain man screaming and shouting on the phone and I took the phone off him and I told him what's what and who's who man. I told him on the phone man. I told him exactly what had happened if he gets sleepy on the phone with my ovary again. But what's he do? He runs to have a nephew instead of a son that he has there as well for basically good fight. But sure, listen, that's not here there. That's, just, that's not my problem basically. Isn't it? You ring Shane, to rings me, man, and says that you got told that I was talking about you, that you wouldn't fight me, man. The whole place knew you wouldn't fight. So you gave me a challenge, man, for seven and a half months. So the words I said, that's no problem. You gave it for the 16th of March. And, Martin, I'm not a full point to go to and think, I'm having a few slaps, Martin, that I won't get marked up. So I said, we'll have it on the 4th, not the 16th, the day before Paddy. We'll have it on the 4th. And he said, that's really two weeks early. I didn't compare about the seven months. And the words I said was, put kick your money down four months before the fight. Martin, I rang Shane two months, over two months ago, and asked me, are you trying to kick your money down? I was told, Martin, you weren't going to put this money down. I, heard, I was told you weren't going to fight. Now, Martin, you can say you can fight. I ain't going to fight, I ain't going to fight, I ain't going to fight. Martin, that doesn't mean anything, Martin. Same way you don't empty promise of all these WhatsApp you're making. He asked you to put the kick money down, you said a few weeks. So I left him, Martin. I rang him again. And man, I had money sitting in here waiting to be dropped off. Why would I drop money off, Martin? You sent for me. You asked for fight. I agreed to fight you. Rang him again, Martin, and he turned around and says, I'll drop it down next week. Well, Shane left you for two weeks, Martin, and rang you back again. And the last message I got off Shane was, you'll put your money down when I put mine down. That's exactly the words you says. Now, Martin, you should be chawing at the bit. You should be kicking and screaming to get this fight on the road with me and you. Now you are. Because now, Martin, you're feeling the fight might kick off when it's supposed to be. That's exactly what it is. So then you say, you see the what's the best of me saying, can't wait to get this fight over. Martin, that was an old WhatsApp or that was an old picture going on or whatever the story was. But anyway, when Shane rang me, I turned around and said to Shane, I will fight you the 4th of March, no problem. Even though I shouldn't. Even though I know and you know I shouldn't, man. But I said I would fight you. I said I'd fight you for £20,000. Now, man, listen. I have a... Because I'm in the gym doesn't mean I'm training for fights. There's two different types of training I do for fights. Because I'm in the gym doesn't mean I'm training for... I wouldn't train and put myself out of my way for a fight with you, man. Knowing well that I might kick off. So I waited, and I waited, and I waited. There was no money put down. Now the fight is three months out, man. Four to March, or whatever, I think the four to March. What is three months? It's over three months. Fights cost money, man. Do you understand me? If you think you're going to hit me in the pocket where it hurts, you have another thing coming. I don't have to fight you. I'll be proven not my fight. And man, no matter of fact, no mean you don't fight, people are going to say you're lucky that we didn't fight. So, man, you're a bet man before we even fight, unless we do fight, and you change people's opinion and people's minds. So, man, we will fight the 4th of March. I'll be ready, man, more than more than enough time for me to be ready in the 4th of March for £20,000. And I will put every on hold, work, Christmas, the whole lot, man, on hold for three months. But you have another thing coming for you, I'm going to put everything on hold for nothing. 
I will fight you the 4th of March for £20,000. Or I'll start my training after Christmas. And I'll fight you in April. You know what's screaming for Mike Stokes and Sons? Michael Stokes has seven, eight, eight, seven, seven, seven brothers, eight sons for fight. Well matched up to all your brothers, man. For the end of April, man, if you all want to fight, me and you, man. Your brother Pat and your brother Willie. Your brother John and your brother Pat. Your brother Michael and your brother John. Your brother Jason and your brother Michael, Arthur and Annie, and our brand new basically for your nephew Brian. Our nephew Martin is anything, Martin is his name is. Martin, there's plenty and plenty of fights there. Michael Stokes has plenty of sons there for fight, 100%. And we'll back up what they say. There's fights there for y'all, for money as well, Martin. The whole lot of you. 